to possess both the Nubian crown and the Horn of Africa is a resplendent adornment for my throne. Together with these tools we marched on the remainder of Egypt. With their toppling came the internal purge of the local nobility. Only good Coptic men and women rule in these lands. Not a single heretic would remain. Then I foisted all my attention and desire upon Alaki. His wealth was not embellished, for he came with many mercenary armies, fighting in the mountains and the deserts alike for his prolonged, decadent survival. If a sultan could not stand before the Nubian Empire, we needed only time to break him. Thereafter, my wife passed on. A partner of mine I've come to appreciate, and mother of my many children. And instead, I focused my attention on foreign affairs. In Jerusalem, the Byzantine Empire, and elsewhere, a house had been planted. In time, We'll see if these matters of subterfuge will pay off. What comes next, you may ask? Well, I have grown old in these decades. Samson III will come to rule soon. I've given him the tools. He need only use them. Now, for my counsel. With the passing of Emperor Gabriel, we now move on to the rule of Emperor Samson III. There have been murmurs about my past, and while this is not my story to share just yet, perhaps in time we can talk about my origins. Merchant, your name wasn't given, but your praises have been noted by the Emperor. While our theology doesn't involve the ideas of reincarnation, we do believe in the strength of habit and blood. Samson III is much like Samson, first of his name. Sir Peridur, Seizing and forming the Kingdom of Yemen isn't something that was considered before, but with your prompting, it may prove to be an ideal place for Samson's younger sons to rule. Not to mention, it would be a sturdy shield as you have claimed. Thank you for your wise counsel. Welcome, warrior. Your audacity to even suggest taking the holy site of Mecca is something that we've not considered. A noble before you, Sir Peridor, said that we should take Yemen. If we do this, and we shall march on the site itself and see that Christendom has won out. Cuius regio, eius religio. Whose realm, their religion. Our council ends now, and we shall see everlasting prosperity in this golden land. I am Sander Graf, your humble counselor. We've got a new situation on our hands here. A new ruler, who's currently 49 years old. The third Samson, the mountain that rides. No kidding. He's a big guy, pretty potent in combat as well. If we have a look over here, my siblings are all alive. I've got Gabriel. I've got another sister, he's only 43. They all have many, many children, though she's not doing very well right now. She's married over to a knight of mine. He's pretty strong for what it is. If we come back over here, I've got over 17,000 men. I've got 1,900 for gold, 1,800 for prestige, plenty of piety, and a lot of renown. I make a lot of renown, so if I want to take a few people away from my line of succession, I can do that. Now, for my daughter, she's going to marry a child of Syria over here. It's matrilineal. He's got over here one older boy. Now, he's not of age yet, but once he's 16, what if something happened to him? We've got big plans here, and we've got to ensure that they all work out. Currently, the king is 71. He's much older. He's married over here to my niece as well. Now, that would be a shame, though. We'll see in time. We've got Gabriel, named after my father. He's pretty good, too. Beautiful, intelligent. A twin as well. Oh, look at that. Wadi El Milk, right over here. They're getting married, so our two lines are going to be combined again. It happens a lot. Here's another boy of mine, 14 years old. He's going to marry no one right now. I could ally England. That's really interesting. They could have children later. Yeah, why not? They could come way over here. They've got some measure of power. Have a look at that. 8,295 men. He's still alive at 73. He's been married more than once. But look at that. 
they've got that one little touch of territory right over there. A young kid rules over there too, which is quite strange. So we've got other lands to conquer, more to take over. And for my council, I've got King Javi. Javi has so much power. He's got a few issues right now and he's put my cousin into prison. She's my friend too, so he better be careful. Another king over here. Look at him. He's losing a war as well. So in time, we might need to change up our council. Then Polycarpos, he's been able to hold on to power. He's been expanding too. Yeah, have a look at that. Another Liberty War. And his children are related to me. We've got Ezekiel, third of his line too, 47 years old. He gets me a lot of money, 30 for stewardship. He's a bit fickle though. Then finally, Dukasi, my patriarch. So these are all my people. I don't need to make a new duchy, not right now. Let's have a look over here. Decisions, my stress levels are okay. I'm gonna go on a pilgrimage. I don't always do that, but I'm doing it today. We'll go maybe a bit further away if I can. Well, Alexandria, Antioch. We'll go to Antioch. I've got the money for it. Why don't we invite some knights over? And what else do we have over here? We've got a doctor. She's really good. I've got a few prisoners too. Goodbye to you, Ali. You're not very good. For every guest that we have here, we could recruit him. He's okay at commanding, but not really the best either. So who are we going to go after? We'll let time move on. I'm leaving right now. If we have a look at Jerusalem, my nephew rules over here. I might try to force him to serve me in time. We shall see. For Syria, well, again, if that young boy goes away for good, and these two have children, Alexander and my daughter, well, it's through a matrilineal marriage. That would be good for my line. Then finally, over here in the Byzantine Empire, their emperor is gonna pass on in time, then Gabriel, a family member of mine is going to rule. A loss of companions. Okay, well, I've got money. I'm gonna hire a few guards. Let's do that. Divine protection. Nope, off we go then. Call it to war, I can help you out. How bad is it, by the way? I'm very curious about that. Oh, they're way over here. I do see that now. Wow, now that's a lot. I'll think about helping out. 18 prowess, really? Yeah, come join me. And there we go. So now, what do I do? I send out some men? Sure, I could do that. Oh, I gave you more money. See, Gabriel gave his son a lot of money and evidently he used it to hire a lot of mercenaries too. So that's good to know. We've got so many over there. I mean, so many over here. I could bring them back. We might as well. Yeah. There's just a lot, really. So, eventually we're all gonna leave and we'll come over here to help out. They've got a lot of men, and I do want them dead. That was pretty quick. The arrival. Now I'm a pilgrim. I'll take more piety. My sister has had a child. Well, that's great. It's really no business of mine. And now, have a look at that. Gabriel. Oh, no. Well, one day, nephew, you're going to rule the empire. She's got to go in prison. And look at that. Cursed by God, a scaly child. I do not like that. But what a strong one too. Maybe one day you'll fight on the battlefield where I'll turn you into a knight. We're going back home now. That was it for my pilgrimage. Do I need more men? I do actually. I don't want Syria to lose. We don't need that in my life right now. Not at all. So I'm gonna bring in even more men. Do I have all my knights over there? I have got 23. Yeah, bring them in. I know it won't be cheap, but let's go. I've got the money. We can go do it, hopefully. Yeah, all of you over here, who's getting married? These two, great. Right over here in Jerusalem. I've got to figure things out later on. Like if I want to claim his title, which I can do that. I might be generous, but I'm also, as you can see over here, a bit impatient. I don't want to wait. That wouldn't be great for me. And sometimes in life, you've got to manage a bit of stress too. So that is what I'm going to do after I beat all of them in combat. A new knight has arrived. Yeah, good, have a child. Great. Who's over here, 43? Join me now. And 10,000 men, let's go. 
training a war horse. I might gain a martial lifestyle perk. I'll take that. I'm getting older. I've got to learn quickly. A steady hand. It's all I need. I've got a high prowess skill. So we did it. I've got a war horse and a new perk. That's great. A name inspired by history. Remember, we had a war horse before. Here's one. Like Alexander the Great. Ideal. Okay, stalwart leader. We'll take that one. That belongs to me. I've got another new knight. We're getting everyone together. We've got to hurry up. That way we can beat them together. There's so many over there. Hopefully we can fight together once and get rid of all of them. What now? My sister. My family has gone to hell. Come on now. I know that. Oh, no wonder. Okay. Right. It was out of her marriage because her husband died. <laughs> I forgot. All right. You know what? I get it. You're grieving. Things aren't great. I understand, okay? Two leaders, right? Two leaders. Let's go. Time to hopefully beat them. Now, there's a lot of them over here. I've got more men on the way right now. Have a look at that. Good, good. Continue to fight. Good job, Gabriel. That's my brother. He killed one of them. We're taking them on. We're beating them right now. Oh, but one knight was maimed. Here's another knight. 23 for prowess. Incredible. What a great warrior. Yeah, these guys are great. Let's come down over here and fight again. If I need to go after any of them, I shall. Let's move up in speed. Let's have a look at that battle too. 30,000 men. Wow, we did it. Oh, they had a really good guy. Michael, good job. You killed him. All right, my brother, 48 years old. Again, very powerful. What a warrior. And we've got someone from far away who's also fighting over here. Well, that's ideal. Okay, so we've got to probably divide up our forces a little bit. We've got way too much here, so why don't we do that right away? All right, company. I want you over here retaking some lands, you two. And down over there. All right. Then another force over here. We're all dividing up. Hopefully our supplies won't go away. That's my hope and dream. You know what, King? Take command. Our allies are also fighting. They probably only really needed help for one battle, I think. Another battle won. Right over here, too. Yeah, we're doing fine. I've got a doctor. Mercenaries are leaving. It happens. We're just taking over what we can while they go to fight. But what a war. It's only for a duchy. Okay, go to prison. Again, Gabriel came of age. These are my children, my wonderful children. My other son, too. That was quick, right? They're twins. How can I forget? All right, well. Good on the two of you. You'll be married in a year. You'll be married in two years, my dear heir. Another Samson. We've got many. Many more on the way. All right, I'm not going to worry about prisoners right now. Abbas said, oh, look who's over here. Another fellow of some note. It's incredible how much they have fallen apart. Now, let's have a look over here. Ezekiel, you know what you need to do. He's like, I know. Let me go back in. And Javi, you're getting kind of large there, buddy. Come on now. Integrate title, 41 years. That's a long, long time. What about Egypt? 46 years. You know what? Get to work. People like me a lot, thankfully. We do not have too much instability. Yeah, many do like me. Oh, is it over? That was quick. Okay, we did help out. Now, you're 73. Your heir over here is a bit older. That's true. Javi died. Yup, he ate too much. He ate way too much. No agents right now. Let's have a look and see. That could change. You two get married. That's great too. There's my son who's now married. Let's come back over here. Donate to charity. I could do that. I'm feeling pretty good, but I could do that anyway. Some stress goes away. I walk away from the church with a light purse and a lighter heart. God is generous. Stress goes down by 24. That is truly ideal right now. So, again, I've got to consider, do I want to go after my nephew? Oh, look at that. He's fighting another war. The Byzantine Empire, they've got many wars going on. They're winning right now. Have a look at Europe. 
They are caught in a terrible fray. Oh no. He's a genius. He's pretty ugly. All right. Inbred too. Oh no, man. You're done. That king over here. They're falling apart. Look there. 53, you're a kin slayer. He's a murderer. His line is holding on. The Dutch line over there is holding on. Denmark has a lot of power, and Kazaria has reunited again, for the most part, too. Oh, man. Look at that chaos. So we're doing okay. Your boy over here is married to my daughter. That's got to change. She came of age. I shouldn't have done that one. But we can do it. I've got all of that power. So beyond that, we do need a new chancellor. I'll have to make it Javi again. Well, his son Javi, who's 21. He's not nearly as good, but I need kings on my side. Now, after that, we've got plenty of things we can do for now. I would like to make a bit more money, sure. And I would also like to claim a new kingdom. I feel the need to do that. There we go. See, we were allied before. I've got a proper claim over here on his title. He's got power. I know it. Now, who are you allied to? Oh, the Byzantine Empire. I could wait for now. I might have to, I think. Because if I attack now... Well, then again, I do have Syria, but I don't want to fight the Byzantine Empire. So, let's make a few different choices over here. Why don't we attack somewhere closer? As I would like to take another holy site from our enemies. There's Mecca, Medina. We could conquer up here and weaken them. That to me is probably a pretty decent idea. They have a lot of power and I would like to gain a bit more of it. Thankfully, what they have is very, very close to me. So let's come over here real quick. I do need my holy order, which again, we did found it. So they're here to fight for free in the name of God. All right. So we've got our soldiers together. Let's go beat them in battle. Then we'll come down and besiege what they have. Enjoy yourself. Yeah, do that. See, he likes me more now. 84. Oh, he wants a title. Well, he's not getting it right now. Good job, knights. A new faction. Wait, who is it? Javi again. Okay, Javi. Don't do that, okay? It's a really dumb idea. Let's sway him over to my side. And who else? Oh, come on now. We've got a few peasants who want to fight too. Let's come on down to their capital. There's a lot happening right now. My mercenaries are leaving. But that's okay too. Now hold on. You've got more work to do. We're just here to convert... Oh, look at that. Actually, we're nearly done. We only have a few more areas to convert. Like here, seven years. Go do it. Wonderful. What a beacon. All right, so we're back down over here trying to take over a good area. Uh-oh. A plot was found out. A plot right over here. I've got no chance to get rid of him now. I could try to bribe a few more people. Yeah, there's only a few who might join me. A demonstration of leadership. My sister and friend has been hovering around my council meetings lately. Knowing her interest in matters of leadership, I cannot help but feel that the woman is waiting for me to impress her. Yeah. We can talk about it. Actually, let's go greet some recruits together. Levy reinforcement rate for two years, up by 25%. Over in Dongola. Alright. There we go. More money spent again. I've got the funds for it. We can keep on doing it. I'll try to. Here's a celebration. Ah. Okay. Now, let's go. We've got some people who can help out. A bit more power to my scheme. I've got a new perk. Chivalric Dominance. Now that's what I need to truly destroy my enemies. Let's be careful. A messenger. No, don't do it. Just take your time. How's my plot strength? Oh, no, no, no. That penalty is way too much. It's been exposed. I would have to wait for a while for that to be okay. Sometimes you can overcome it, but... That's all right. All right, so my daughter can be married now to that young man. They are related, but look, not too closely. Learning self-defense. One day, I took a walk in a meadow in a nearby town when I saw an old gentleman surrounded by a few women. Upon closer investigation, I noticed they were practicing arm and leg movements. 
Oh, hand-to-hand -hand combat. The Elder was a veteran of many wars. Well then, I'll show you what I know. Look at that, more prestige, more popular opinion. Here's an invitation over here to Ghazali Monastery. One of my forefathers went here many years ago. And sure, pay to heal up my steed. We do need that. And I bumped into a knight. A lot is going on for me. We did win one siege. That gave me how much? 65 gold. Wonderful. Okay, but we're not done yet. We've got more to fight. Let's do that before I run out of supplies. They're trying to move up. Which is all fine and dandy. We've got them here in a battle. Let's go. It's a very quick battle. And it's over. Let's have a look at the details. I lost only 275. Mariana, good job. He's a good king. A mighty king at that. Oh, Jedvard. You ripped off a man's head. And Michael. You got a guy too. We caught so many. I mean, that battle wiped them all out. Now, it's over. What a way to go. And I've got more territory than before. I've got to give away some of it. Yeah. I think I've got to. I'm trying to conquer up north just bit by bit. If I can do that, well, that'll solve a lot of issues, I think. Mecca right over here. I'll think about it. I'm going to find a new leader for these lands way out down over here. It could even be one of my own children who have come of age. Like you, Gabriel. I could give you some land over here. Yeah. But I do want a proper title for you. I can make it. There, perfect. Okay. Let's go back real quick and come back over to my son. I'll let you roll over here. It's a harsh land, but you'll do a good job. Wonderful. Okay. I'm going to give him some money too. It's what I do for my kids. And because I like to give away money, it's all right. So have a look at them. They've got one ally. He's only got so much power. Interesting. Oh, he's way over here. <laughs> no, he's not going to help out. Now back over to Syria. 74 years old. He's not feeling great. And you, you're doing fine. There's no way for me to kill him right now. But there is a way for me to rally my men over here to conquer more lands. Oh, you know what I want. I want all of Mecca. Why don't we do that? Now here's a really cool part. I can call on a few allies. I've got a lot of prestige. But I can also call upon house members. There we go. Jerusalem. Gabriel over here of the Byzantine Empire. That's great. Though he doesn't have a lot of power yet. Now, my daughter, you can be married. Who should you marry? Prince Anak? That's an option, I suppose. Is there anyone who's got a great claim somewhere? Maybe not. Then, there you go. Mary. And it's all done. Let's see. What else do we have? Well, we can wait for now. Because I want my allies to join me in a war here. A war that is going to be quite difficult. Have a look at what we're trying to conquer. Wait, Al-Mutaz? Have a look at that too. 60 years old, but he's still going. He's got over 5,400 men over in Baghdad. That's why I've got Syria coming to join me and Jerusalem too. They should be a great help. Already we're winning. Really now? Well, I do like that. I've got your heir in my prison. Really? Ha, <laughs> incredible. But not only are we having to fight over here in Desert Mountains, which I hate. We've also got a very low supply limit. That worries me quite a bit. So I'm going to be patient. I'll go fight them in a bit. What now? You want to marry my boy? Well then. They're married. They did it. I've got to save up a bit of money. I've got prisoners. And it's a good thing I did not auction all of them off back to their family members. That ransom has not been done. Up to the job now. What's over here? You could stay here with me. Or what about Ezekiel? Sure, be angry, but gain more stewardship. It benefits all of us. Your pride may be hurt, but that's all right. How's my son doing? He's not very good at fighting. And that old man passed on. We have a new king of Syria over here. Well then. We can ally. Sure, why don't we do that for now? Eventually things may have to change, but I would like for you 
to stay as my friend. Okay, if we could lure them out and fight their armies outside of the desert mountains, that would be ideal because, again, have a look. My numbers wouldn't really matter too much. It would be quite difficult to take on what they have. Now, another option. I suppose I could bring up my regiment. Grave robbers. What's over here now? Let them go. I'm a pretty kind guy, I think. I've also got my holy order. I could bring them in. That's an option, too. But here we go. Get everyone up. Nikolaus, 43 years old. Interesting. Ah, that family right over here. Ezekiel's line. An unworthy challenge. Sure, 18 prowess. Come join me right now. His stat line isn't too shabby for what he's going to be doing. That's fine for me. My holy order? Well, they're out there. What about my stallion? Let's work on endurance. My money's going down, but I'm going to be okay. Now, my allies are over here. I'm going to move up myself, and I'm going to try to take their capital. If I can do that, maybe we can end our war. Yeah, my allies are close by. It's really cool to me how strong we have become. And come on now, you know better. Here's some money. I'll give you that much to go away, over 200 gold. I'll make more, don't worry about it. Generous and provident. Despite my penalties, I still make so much money. Oh, have a look at it. Mecca. We're going to take over everything that we can. We've got to. His faction is gone. Yeah, it's all Mecca over here. That entire duchy. And I do want it all. We are going to take it all. Army of Jerusalem. Okay, could you send more men? He's like, nope, you get two. You'll get two and you'll like it. Okay, as it currently stands, we've got many enemies currently on the way, which is not ideal. So, I might need to bring in more. Oh, wait, hold on. They're over here. They are bringing in more. That's good. Come back and wait. Of course, if they attack, they'll get a defender's bonus. I won't have that. So, if we conquer quickly, we'll be okay. My allies are also close by. Who's raiding? Oh, don't do that. You're a fool then. Hold on. You're from where? There? Okay. I'll come visit you. Don't worry about it. I've got your number now, buddy. I know where you live. My brother had an affair with my niece. Oh, the crime's over here of my family. All of you need to stop it. He's a bit lusty, but come on now. That's way too much. Supplies are looking good right now. We're holding up. They're moving around. They're not trying to stop me. We only need to take one area right over here. And we've got it. We did it. If I didn't call in allies, that would have been a very difficult war. We caught him. You didn't come out to fight. What a fool. So now I've got your territory. Even better. I'm stronger than I was. I've got to give away more land, which I can do. I could save up too. All right, let's come over here now to my chancellor. I'll take a king, Gabriel. Yeah, you'll be my chancellor. That'll do for now. Get everyone to like me more. Yeah, see, kings want council positions, and that can cause me issues. So over here, I'm going to do a mass ransom. We'll get some money back. I'm known for my dedication to my faith. We all know that. The rest of you, I suppose you may be free. Here's a Tulanid. She's 20. Yeah, be gone. Be gone now. Their line is still very much alive. Do they have any leaders at all? That's a good question. Let's have a look. Let's see, rank? Yeah, there we go. One captain. Keepers of the lighthouse. And another one, really? The ginger knight. Hmm. He leads what? <laughs> Two other champions? Good for you, buddy. He's doing okay in life. Two people follow him. More than usual, you know? Okay, so if I conquer you soon, that could change up a lot for us, you know? I do want all of Mecca. That is my goal. Oh, what a claim over here, too. I like that. That is a really good claim. You've got some territory, but you could have more. You're also quite old. Well, actually, hold on. Let's come back over here. All of Mecca. It is what I want. We'll give it a moment. I'll find a good ruler over here. We're going to have a much easier time taking over over here. They've got some money. Well, good for them. It's crazy how wealthy our enemies have been. But 
That's alright, it provides a greater challenge for me. 12.3 gold is really not bad. Not bad at all. Speaking of not bad, let's come over here. Who might join me in my plot? I mean, <clears throat> not my plot. Who's going to potentially be around unfortunate events? Yeah, King. You're young. You're prone to foolish choices. Look at him. He's got a gift. He's got... Oh, he's kind. He comforted a heartbroken lad. He's like, don't worry. No one will ever stab you in the back. All right. I'm going to give away more territory later on, but not yet. I've got those two areas. I can feudalize one of them. That's true. I think I might give it away to one of my children. There we go. But I'm also quite impatient, so here I go. No, really, I'm quite impatient. Have a look. Right there. Minus two to learning. But I gain a lot more prestige because I'm here to get things done today. Yeah, I've not really used my levies, have I? That's been intentional, though. They can be a pain. Train commanders. Yeah, that's still on. All right. I've got a pretty good council. They're all doing fine. And now we're just getting together over here. Let's get everyone together. I could also call in allies. That's true. House members. Come on, Gabriel of Jerusalem. And we've got one over in the Byzantine Empire as well, but I don't want anything to happen to him. Only his father. Haha. -ha. We'll see in time what may happen. I'm in debt? Me? No. It shouldn't last for too long. We'll be okay. A cask of wine. Oh, enjoy your drink. Yeah, sure, do that. Oh no. Look at that. He followed me willingly, drunk on merriment and wine into the cellar. After many glasses of fine wine, he fell readily asleep and didn't even stir as I brought out a trowel. <gasps> no. Did we no- Oh no. We left him downstairs in a wall. Fortunately, no one seems to have noticed the queer new wall in my basement. You're kidding me, that's evil. Oh. I mean, it's one thing to stab him, but to do that, horrible. Okay, well, building accidents happen all the time, okay? Maybe we need some new standards, some new codes, because he's gone now. Let's have a look over here. Jazeera. See, look at that. Now, your child, your genius, beautiful, strong dwarf child will become the king after you pass on. So we're doing well. We just need that child to come of age. We want him to have more children just in case. Now, I'm going to bring in my allies, as you can well see over here. I've got King Alexander, who could join in too. Sure. I've got a lot of prestige. Let them come join me. What about my military leader? Do we need anyone new? My vassal? Ah, oh, Gabriel. You're busy again. He's such a good military leader too. Like my father. Well, like he was. Okay, off we go. Come join me. They have a lot of men, and now we're fighting again. 8,900 men. My boy was wounded, but only wounded. Okay, we're winning. We've beaten them. They had 19 knights. One was killed, evidently. And we won. My glory is widely known, as it well should be. Okay. We're done with what we have right now. Who's a cannibal? Pardon me, you're a cannibal? Oh, dear. I do not like that. Javi, he likes me a lot. I don't need to worry about money. We're doing fine. Let's go back down and besiege. My allies are also over here, but we're going for Mecca. You're my rival? Really now? Would you calm down, okay? We don't need to be rivals. We're family, but she wants to cause an issue. My supplies are okay for now, but here it is. Let's have a look again. Right over here. Mecca. It's such a good idea to take away their holy sites. That's what we're doing right now. Later we'll go after Medina. Right over here. I think after my Indian campaign, I'll play one over here for some country in the Middle East. Some state. Some kingdom. If any of you have ideas, you can let me know when the time comes. My kinswoman had a child. Is she okay? Oh, she beat herself, and she's kind of, you know, not well. All right, well, have fun. Oh, you two are related. But then again, that happens a lot. My family is large and powerful. We'll come over here now. They've got 9,000 men close by? Wow. 
Now that's crazy. We've got to go fight them. I've got no choice right now. We do need more supplies, but we also have got to win. Catch one army. Do it now. You did it. Good job. Beat them now. Oh. You ripped off a man's head. Wonderful. Let's have a look real quick. We'll come over here to besiege... For that is what we do or we go around fighting everyone i don't want to fight in the mountains really i do want more supplies what i could do i could always come back down over here but let's go besiege all right so back over here i lost only 59 men in that first battle oh they did a lot of killing and over here again we did lose a lot more over 1000 men look at that oh one of my boys died. He was my military commander. He served me for a very long time. The warrior giant. Another one killed. Wow. Yeah, my champions did a great job. Now, you passed on. Your son does not match your name. We'll change it up. Don't worry about it. It's how we keep track of our mini characters. Okay, we'll come over here. Name him after you. You can see how many characters we've really had. I mean, it's been a lot. Okay. My niece and my son are now married. Again, it's tough because she's Amazonian. Beautiful. My boy over here is Herculean. Beautiful. Oh, I probably should have found a genius for him, but he's not my direct heir. Can't dispute. I'll deliver a speech about unity here. There. We are stronger together. and People are happier. Now... Let's find some manner of intellectual to come join us. I'll take Never Back Down. We're here for a few military advantages. That's what we need. I need more money, I know that much. And who do we have? Anyone good? 14 learning, 17 learning. Well, Solomon, I suppose you could have a new position. It'll take some time, but you can learn. He's quite educated. He's like, okay, I'll do it. I'm a book nerd and I'll do it. All right. They're besieging a few areas, which is interesting. So here's what I'm going to do. I need a new military commander. It'll be you. We'll go after their capital. We've got allies over here. We should be able to take it quickly. I've got the tools I need. Half a year. That's it. But look at what they're doing. They're having a pretty tough time. Good luck to them. Who's raiding me? Oh, you are. What a dumb, dumb idea. Okay. Oh, it's you, right. Holy crap. 13,000 men. Over 10,000 mercenaries? It's crazy how much more gold has been around than in previous campaigns. I like it because it makes my life much more challenging. Usually by the time we're in Empire, people can't challenge me, but that one Baron in Alaki that we fought, he was difficult. He wasn't even easy to fight. We had to be careful. And I thought that was very cool. All right, they're coming back down. We need to go beat them. I need more supplies. I don't know if my allies are going to help me out, but let's find out. We're going in anyway. Oh, I hate it so much. 15,000 men. Owner is in a bit of debt. Let's go. The Battle of Mecca. We've got our allies here, and we beat them again. Okay, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to come back down because we do need more supplies. That was a little bit scary. I did let it move by quickly. That gave me 487 for fame, 243 for devotion. A child of my dynasty. Name him after... Gabriel. There. Oh, that was really good. Another prince dead. How many princes have been killed already? One prince right now. Oh, you are great. Marathi. Indo-Aryan group. I see now. Okay. Well, let's go down and get more supplies. I've got the money. I can give away territories. So we're going to take our time and we'll give away these lands. Well, I've got to wait for now. We're quite busy at the moment in the middle of a war. Those raiders do bother me, but let's have a look again. My prisoner died. Sultana. Oh. Interesting. That was your wife. Someone. Alright, one more faction is gone. Do we have any... No, we have no powerful factions around. I've got over 800 gold. We're just waiting here for now. They're coming back to retake lands from me, which is unfortunate. But we'll be back up there in just a moment.
I've got how much for supplies? Well, not a lot. I need to actually move somewhere else. See, I got too many men. Let's move back down. And we'll go back up and fight them again. They're going to retake it, which is fine. Because, I mean, look at that army. It's huge. They've got a big army. I've got a big one, too. And we'll uh, duel later. Our friend over here did create a faction to rise up against me. He's older and a bit foolish, but that's okay. Now, we've got supplies. Let's go back over here and fight them all. We can do that. So Jer died, really? Wow, the Cordial Snake. What an interesting title. Your son is very good at intrigue, like you were. They're all very good at intrigue, but he's quite good. You know what? I've got to bring you back to my council. You might be a king, but come on now. Oh, wait, then again, my son over here would be even better. Perfect. That would give him experience, which is what he needs. Do we have a better marshal? We do not. What about a chancellor? Barely better. Ezekiel is by far the best when it comes to stewardship. If only I could change up my patriarch. But for now, let's go back out and fight again. Are my allies all here? They should be. They very well should be. All right. We've got to ally again, don't we? Done. What about you, young man? Ah, giant. Well, good for you. You're married to my niece. And you're from my house, too. He's my nephew. Yeah, we can ally. I can help him out. But I do want more help. So I'm going to call him into the war. Let's see here. Offer to join war. Well, okay, good. He's still in my war. I just had to be sure. I had to be sure. All right, so we're all moving. Thank you, Ezekiel. Speaking of, he heard my praise. 455 gold. That's a lot of money. Now, if we can go get them, that would be great. If not, they can come back and we can just take what's over here. Oh, yeah, we'll do that. They're besieging some lands, but that's okay. It's a long war. It's been how long? Four years. I'm currently 56. I'm getting older. Sure. Now, I don't mind fighting a long war fighting them, and I'll tell you why. Because it's going to weaken them. My goal is to break them apart. They've got way too much power right now, and they're going to lose a lot if I'm careful. There we go. I'm capturing so many of what they have over here, so I think it's really working out pretty well. Combined together... We've got our supplies. Yeah, sure. Care for my stallion. I've got so much money. We can spend it after the war. It's a great way to save up right now. Oh, they're being annoying. The challenge. A practice duel? Oh. Sure, son. I've beaten you, and that's okay. That's okay, my boy. You're learning. Okay, so now let's go retake lands. We're nearly done. We just need a bit more. I'm very happy with how the war turned out. I usually end them quickly, but again, I'm just being careful here. Who needs help? You need help? I'm not going to tell you no. And I do need a new perk, so I get more knights on my side, more champions. Four more at that. I'll create some new titles once we're done here. All right, so we're done over here, but we also need to go back and fight that army of 13,000 men. Thankfully, we did take it, so they won't get that defender benefit. Here we go. I'm alone. What an awesome conclusion to the war. It's our final battle, and it's over here in Medina. Oh, Mariana, you were maimed, but you fought well in your older years. And we did it. Have a look at that. He did lose a leg. 397 for fame, 198 for devotion. They lost 4,394 men. We lost 703 men. And have a look at that. Jedvard, you wily guy, you. Oh, what a strong guy. We killed so many. Just in general. Okay, it's over now. We've won five years of fighting, but we finally got it. There's another basic war right over there, but that to me is not a big deal. Now, let's come back. We've got to go disband what we have. Let's move quickly. Everyone is done over here. I can finally feudalize that area. I can create some new titles. Let's see. Right over here. Yemen. I'll take that. Duchy of Mecca. And that duchy. You know what? I'll make that too. Look at my prestige. It is quite high. Mahmoud, the half man. You know what? Be gone. I want your money. 100 gold. I'll take yours too. And we've got one more. 10 gold. Wonderful. Okay, come on down. 
Now I'm going to invest a bit of money over into my own lands. We'll give away some more titles. I can't build anything truly unique over here for my duchies yet. It takes such a long time. But build that up. Whatever I can do to help out right now, I want to try. Yeah, see, I can't upgrade. There goes a lot of my money, but that's all right. Look at what I own now. So much more. And I've got some more things I can do locally, which I'm going to think about. Jazeera, you could be doing better. You've broken apart a little bit. Aleppo, you're alone. I don't like that. We'll have to talk about it. Now we just need a bit of money. I'm pretty broke at the moment. And as you can recall, I did spend a long time setting up marriages all over. I mean all over. Now we've got people from my house on nearly every single throne. Jerusalem, the Byzantine Empire, Jazeera over here, though they're not nearly as powerful as they probably should be. For now, let's wait for just a brief moment. Again, because I need more income. And I'm not making nearly as much due to being generous and in providence. Oh, you passed on at 62. Okay, your son needs to be renamed after you. Otherwise, I won't know where he comes from. There we go. Javi, I know you passed on at only 53. Quite young, by the way. Who else died? Yeah, you did. You died as well. And what now? Scheme discovered. What a shame. Right, I probably should tell you. I'm trying to potentially remove another problem. I've got the money. We just need to take our time. There we go. It shouldn't be too difficult. He's already had many, many children. And he's going to outlive me if we go by natural means. So over here, my wife is currently 55. She's actually not feeling great, unfortunately. She hasn't converted yet. She's currently Catholic. My niece has given birth to a daughter. Sure. Name her whatever you want. Now, England. You've got lands over here that you shouldn't. I wonder if I should take over over here. <laughs> I'll have to think about it. All right, you know what? Come over here, get me a claim. It'll take two years, it shouldn't be too difficult. Now, my kinsman died, Mary and Kuda. Your child is quite good at learning, by the way. Wow, 23, good for him. Let's come back over here too, and we can hold on. When it comes to who I need to go after, that really depends. I'm still waiting on getting more money. I'm now working on War Camels. Okay, good. And Nightly Practice. I could gain a new perk. Let's try it out. Aggressive Attacker. I'll take it. More Fatal Enemy Casualties. Beautiful. I love that. And now we've got it. Oh, do you like spiders? Let's find out. Does he? He does. Well, maybe he shouldn't. He's gone now. And his kingdom has been divided up into two. We'll have a look at that. Now, what should we do about that? Oh, you've got a lot of power. Interesting. A lot of mercenaries, as usual, as we well know. They do love their mercenaries. Now, young boy, you've got things you should not. I would like a claim over here. I can't do it through religious means. But what about claiming your title because, well, I lead our house. Done. There's one. Here's another. Let's do it again. Claim title. And done again. Sure, I'm a bit more stressed out, but here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go on a hunt. There. Now I feel better, and it's about time for me to go to war. I've got to take over many, many lands, and I'm going to. They have no allies. We might as well get two lands for one. I'm going to take over. I told you what my goal was before. Nothing will stop me. Not one thing. In the very beginning, my goal, if you need a brief reminder, is to go over and take over every single holy site. So we'll do what we can. Now, let's get everyone together right over here. So I've been taking my time. I just need a few levies. The stag. We'll go get it. We press on. Be angry. Oh, right, you were in my prison. Well, you're gone now. Okay, after that, let's see. You are currently converting cultures. We just need maybe a few levies. Perfect. How many do we need? Not too many, I think. 5,000? That's a decent amount. Sure, okay. Let's come over here to their capital. We can make it straight there, and I can move through overland. A good kill. 
Who are you? Oh, no one. <laughs> no one at all. Returning from the wild, 150 for prestige. Well, that's great. Oh, they definitely can't beat me. They can try, but it's not going to work out. We'll go after the capital. Now, keep in mind, we've got young children here. If I capture them, that's it. We can end the war without too much bloodshed. And hold on. Let's come back. You know what we're going to do. I could also begin increasing our overall development back at home. It might be time for that. Sure, why don't we do that? How's my development anyway? Only 12. There should be more. Oh, here we go. Scouting post, I'll take it. Nice work. That's very good. I'll take that right now. All right. So we're going back to war. Let's have a look. We'll get Damascus. Oh, darn. I was hoping to end it right then and there. I'm getting older now. I don't have too many years left, do I? I'm feeling fine, thankfully. That's quite good. I've got a barony. I'll give it to a low noble. And we'll go back to fighting over here. Now, that gave me 40 gold. I could take over down here before they can take over their capital again. Let's go back up. How's the child feeling? Oh, ill? Well... They've got our blood. They're going to be okay. Unfortunately, we've got to fight a battle. I don't really want to, but I've got to. We're not quite done, but we're about to be done. That's only one war. After that, we've got to march on again, though my supplies are going down. My best friend died. My cousin, which is a shame. Okay, Gabriel, you want to be married? Be married then. Do that. Okay, let's hold on. A new perk. I'll take what's over here. Serve the crown. Here we go. I can declare wars easily. Not that I need to worry. I've got a lot of prestige anyway. Lessons from the past. Studied an old battle. Plus one to marshal. And you don't want to be my rival? No. You can be my rival. It's okay. I don't mind. It doesn't bother me at all. Boiling anger. I mean, if you want to yell at me, that's okay too. Again, I'm the emperor here. All right, that gave me 30 gold. We've won one area. Have a look at that. Wonderful. And he's my vassal too, which is truly ideal. I've got many vassals. We'll try to reorganize lands over here later on. I could use more supplies. We'll actually let them come back after eight months, okay? Then we'll go back to war over to the northeast. I don't want to wait out over here. I feel like it takes a longer period of time. I could be wrong, but... Have a look at that. We're finally conquering elsewhere. The Byzantine Empire, they're having an issue. We'll have to look at that later. But they could potentially lose two wars. Hopefully they won't. They've got some money. How bad is it? Ooh, really bad. Now, are they trying to topple you? Interesting. What's their overall goal just to be free? Okay. They've got a big faction. We'll see in time. Oh, no, but I need him to stay on there. You know what? Why don't you convert? Let's do that. I can tell the Byzantine Emperor to convert. Incredible. Okay, then after that, what I can do... I could join your war. Ah, he's not my ally, but he could be. But I don't want to be allied to him, too. But I also need him to stay in control. Or we're going to have a few issues. I'll have to think about it. Okay, it's been a crazy part, really crazy, because if I do everything right, we're about to have a very interesting situation here, where we're going to have control of Jerusalem, then later even more lands over here, all of Syria, then if we play it right, if we support the Byzantine Empire, or they win somehow, then we get to take over over here too. I would have so much land mass in a very short span of time. Samson... You're quite old. I don't think you could do it in your lifetime, but it is a possibility. His own son is not a giant, the very first one of his line. However, he is a genius. So we traded up being a giant for being a genius, which is okay. And to me, he looks very cool. So we'll see in time what's going to come of it. But thank you for watching, everyone. Get ready for a new council. And as a reminder, our next campaign is going to be over in India. We've got many ideas, and I've got a lot of reading to do, but we're going to choose something cool. And as always, until then.